Hey guys, Quackenstein Monster here. Welcome to the now mostly blind gaming experience of Bratz Flaunt Your Fashion for the Nintendo Switch. Before we begin, this video is not meant for kids due to my foul mouth. Viewer discretion, like always, is an absolute must, and let's not forget that this project is dedicated to my sister. With any luck today, we will be finishing this project off in this video, so yay! Because this area is really giving me endgame vibes here. Uh, damn, long load times are long. Don't mind that gurgling in the background. That is just my coffee pot. Alright, here we go. We're going to be revisiting a little bit, but we're just going to speed through this. Perfect. This is plink. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta go talk to the stage organizer. We gotta get our chests. All four of them. Yes, I found, I've discovered I might have been missing one. So probably a good thing my progress didn't get saved. Bitch. Here's number two. Hmm, by the way. Important looking suitcase out in the middle of nowhere. If this game falls under any sort of pattern, this won't be unusual at all. That's two. There's three right there, and there's one in one of these little rock gardens that we're going to be picking up, so. I've collected money, and apparently money is style. Remember, these are the things that are mine and not yours. Though when you play it, these will be yours and not mine. And keep in mind, on other platforms, finding all these damn things will be a trophy, so. Or achievement, or whatever they want to call it. I'm old school, I call them bragging rights. Alright, bitch, we've already heard your little bullshit before. You got that right. I've been trying to say what color do you oh. like best? Uh pink. Great thinking. Ooh, Shut up, bitch. You know, it does look good. Don't care. Either way. She's meant to be stuck. Could you help yes, me find Yes, not very absurd. About this far, turn to your left. She's right here. Hey, girl. No strap. Oh, hi. Oh, no. You look. No, no, nothing like that. But I can't decide what theme to go for. The styling soiree. Could you help me out? What theme? Uh, I went with pink and white for this. Nice. Let's do Makes everything nice, a pop out nice and brilliantly, I think. 
Wow, that looks. Oh, I totally forgot. All right. Yo, Beretti, I think you lost something. Oh, by the by the way, I did say uh, mostly blind. Yes, I've tried recording this a few times, and something gone on with the computer, and one time it actually crashed, so. Hey, dumbass. Heard you wanted me. What do you want? Oh, yes. You oh, lost your suitcase, and Mr. in Barretti, the last part, this going? is where I, I left it as uh, a cliffhanger. No probs. What's up? I seem to have misplaced my suit. Can you help me find On it. Girls? Hmm. Find the suitcase. Now, haven't we seen something like that before? Well, well, well. Remember what I said about it? A certain object down here being completely out of place and extremely important. Oh, gee, now this has a fucking question mark on it. And remember, things like this usually fall under the case of it's out of place, it's important, get it. All right, dumbass. You, citizen, out of my way. I'm a brat on a mission. Yo, dumbass, keep a better eye on your shit next time. Missing suitcase delivery. Ah, oh, perfecto. Thank you, Chloe. Now, why don't we take a peek inside? There! What do you think? Four designer dresses just for you. For the brats, I could give nothing less than perfection. So each gown was hand-sewn by your proudest mentor, me. You've got to be kidding, Mr. B. These are for us? They're scorching! Oh, Mr. Beretti, thank you. We have to get you, like, a fruit basket or something. A fruit basket? Yes, that is so not styling. Quick, girls, go try them on and take a picture of the step and repeat. And when you're done, perhaps you could ask the boy band if they're ready to perform. I will say, these do look pretty good. All right, Sasha. Don't be pull a jade and insistently cover up one of your friends here in a pose. You did exactly that. But you know what? I'm not retaking it. I could see most of Jade. So, good enough for me. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, now we gotta talk to Blonde Ken with the lip injections. Keep my eye on you. So if Ken's around, Barbie's sure to follow. And I know you're the one who invited this bitch. Dylan, report. You've got nothing to report, nothing suspicious? All right, you live. For now. All right, where is Douchey McDumbass? No, you're not even blonde. Right gender. Oh, there he is. Hey, dumbass. Get your bitch ass on stage. Well, if it isn't the Bratz Rock Angels, looking good, ladies. I'd love to chat, but I'm kind of in the middle of a musical emergency. 
We're on in a couple minutes, but I can't find my bandmates. The noise boys are the best, but sometimes I swear it's like herding cats. Could you help me round them up? It's simple. You put a very small shot collar on their dicks. Time to get uh, together. You push the buttons. And they'll come a-running. They'll probably call you an asshole. But they'll come a-running. But they won't ever down to your leadership again. <laughs> they'll know who's... <laughs> Who's in charge? A dumbass. Not walk away. Some canapes. Showtime? Yeah. Get moving, you fucking dumbass. Eaten. Just be you. I think there's like one up here, maybe? Oh, that's you. It's the girls. Yep, thought so. You, stage now. You off your ass and get ready to go. Alright, dumbass, I found him. Wasn't that fucking hard either. You know, it would have been a lot easier if you would have just moved the fuck around. And not stand here with your thumb up your ass. Alright. Noise is back together and ready to rock. Wait. Why is my lead singer miming at me like that? No time for charades, man. You're, uh, one syllable. A dog. No. A cat? Uh, a horse. You're a horse. Oh no, I get it. Your horse. Your voice is gone. Ugh. Talk about bad timing, bro. If our front man can't sing, there's no way we can do the gig. Ladies, do you think you could fill in for us? <laughs> no problem. We've got your back. Totally. I know some scorching dance moves we could do. Major thanks. Have a blast up there. You're gonna tear the roof off this place. Let the secret designer know when you're ready to perform. Sure thing. Just keep in mind what I said about the shot collars on the nuts. They'll never doubt your authority again. Of course, they'll never trust you again. But they'll know you're ruthless. Alright, now we're back into new territory. That's why I let that cutscene play out. Because just as I was uh, getting ready to hit the record button, damn laptop crashed on me. So, yeah, that was fun. Not. Uh, Alright, you're not him. Yo, asshole. We're ready. I can't believe you did it! The styling soiree is a high fashion hit! The music, the lights, the decor! And I hear you're our new headlining act. To think, the Rock Angels! Brats, your stage awaits. You ready for your opening number? Bring it on.
Yeah, this is definitely giving me in-game vibes here. Yeah, that's... That's what I thought. It's one of these games. Let me just re-familiarize myself with the controls. All right. Holy shit, these things are not fucking around. It's a slow fucker on this thing. It's going to be preceded by a speedy one. That's got to take the priority. Girls, did you just do the fucking Macarena? I gotta say, that was close. But I was ready for it. Oh, one mess up. Fucked up on the end. Oh well. Sorry, just having some coffee. Chloe, all I got to say on your pose is, what the hell? What the hellman's mayonnaise? But yeah, I was right when I said this was the end game. I know I didn't have music going on, but you know, copyright and all that happy horse shit. But yeah, that was Bratz Flaunt Your Fashion for the Nintendo Switch. Uh, overall, not a bad game. Didn't mind it too much. Uh, that Felicia quest set can just fuck right off. And honestly, it's not because of how she's designed or anything like that. I mean, they could have made her a Asian, white, Hispanic, whatever. No, I still would not have liked the character. But I'm hoping that it was just the port that led up to my biggest thing that I didn't care too much for on this. And that was uh, long load times are long. Seriously, that was the only thing about this I did not like. It was the long load times and that Felicia character. Ugh.
But this will wrap it up. What do I have next lined up? Well, I recently got me a better uh, uh, converter for the PS2. Uh, it's it's a good PS2 to HDMI converter. The only thing that it doesn't let me do is play PS1 titles on it, because, well, I need a proper upscaler for that. So, for PS1 titles, I'm either going to be hitting up the PS3 for those, or I'm just going to say, fuck it and emulate it. And that'll be done off the phone. As for what's coming up next, uh, I'm thinking about picking up, uh, um, actually starting the, uh, picking up an old, even older, uh, walkthrough that I started years ago. I haven't finished it. I need to. And I'm thinking about picking up the other half of the split console walkthrough of mine of Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Record one or two videos of that, along with a PS2 revisit. Uh, that game in question is Bratz Rock Angels. I know I streamed it last time. But... Uh, that was only because I didn't have this converter at the time. So I think I'm going to do like one, a couple videos of that, uh, along with a couple of MK Armageddon. Um, so yeah, that being said, I want to thank you guys for watching this whole project from start to finish. Sis, I hope you enjoyed the walkthrough that are dedicated for you. Thank you for letting me borrow your console for this. And, uh, hope this brings some cheer to you. With that being said, farewell everyone. See you next project.